Okay, guys, so what we got over here and over here is a Dollar Tree Dollar Store find. This is pretty cool, guys. Let's see if we can show you what we got over here. And guys, you get all these. It's a called a six in a one, a stylus pen, you know, or staletto, staletto, six in unoto. So we get a pen in there. We get a stylus. We get a ruler. We get a level. You know, you have the level. You got the bubble that goes back and forth and whatnot. And then we got a screwdriver. We got a flat screwdriver. All for one dollar. That's like crazy Eddie type stuff, guys. You know what I mean over here? So let's open up the box and show you what we got. Okay, guys. So number one, this is a pen over here. See how it pops out like a little turtle head? So we got a pen. We can do a little escribe. You know what I mean? And then if we go to the back, Jack, we got a stylus. You know, not a hair stylus. You can't cut hair with this, guys. Don't get it confused. But if you got like a touch screen on your uh, laptop or whatnot, or maybe an iPhone, you know, the little rubber butt end here, they call it a stylus. So you got that, which is pretty cool. Then we flip it over here, and now we got a ruler, guys. So we can actually, you know, do inches, and we can do centimeters, and maybe millimeters, all that good stuff. So this is kind of like a carpenter-type pen, how it's giving you that, too. So then, let's see, we spin it around. One, two, flip it over here, upside down for you. And we actually got a little lever, or, or level gauge, I guess you would call it. And you see that bubble? It's hard to see here, guys, but it's going back and forth. So maybe you want to hang up a picture or TV or whatnot. Maybe you can actually use this. I don't know, but that would be pretty cool. So then we go back to the back, and we're going to actually unscrew this here, guys. Let me show you how we do that. We just twist it a little bit. And guys, look, now we got a Phillips head screwdriver. By the way, guys, did you know that somebody was named Philip and he invented the Philip head screwdriver? I just made that up, guys. I don't know, but it was probably named after somebody named Philip, right? So this is actually even magnetic. So it's not going to fall or go bye bye. You know, it's just going to stay there. And then if we flip it out, there we go. We got the flat end. And guys, you probably won't believe this, but believe it. Somebody's last name was Flathead, and uh, they always kept calling him, hey, Flathead. I guess he had a box haircut, and they named the Flathead Screwdriver after him. Um, actually, I made that one up too, guys, but, you know, it could have happened. I don't know, but that's pretty cool, guys. So then we pop that back on, screw it on. So we get six different things total, guys. I mean, that is excellente in Italiano. And uh, I don't know how you say that in English because I don't speak too good English sometimes. So, guys, one dollar at the dollar store. You can get it in green over there. You can get it in blue. They got red. They got bet on black. All that good stuff. So, hopefully, you enjoyed this little uh, mini review of this Divine Stylish pen. You know, you keep it in your car, could be handy. Uh, you keep it in your toolbox. I actually bought two because you really get a lot of bang for your buck, you know. So please, guys, if you haven't already, if you like my videos, why not subscribe? It's the right thing to do, and I'd really appreciate it. And uh, any comments or questions, or maybe you found other uses for this, or maybe it saved your life, uh, let us know your experiences down below. All right, well, I'm signing off, so take it easy and see you later.